great idea. Taking the radio show and putting it on television. It's brilliant. Explosive television. Shocking television. This is good television. This is genius. Baba Fuha, bring in Mark Hamill if he wants to sit in for this. It's my hero. Yeah, from Star Wars. Did you get in trouble for uh, What's the broccoli? getting on Gary about his uh, about his telephone? Uh, no, not really. Oh, you saw that? Seem too happy. <laughs> want to know my theory on Gary's breath? Go ahead. How come you never ask me? I want to know your theory. Well, I don't think you do. I think Robin does. Robin <laughs> we likes it. We discuss your breath all the time. I tell Robin my theory, then Robin jumps in, and then you get mad at Robin. So that's how it works. Right, Robin? That's right. Okay, so let's see if we can make that happen now. Okay. All right. And, Ga and Gary, as hard as you try not to get upset, you will. And then after this test, quarantine this phone, okay? <laughs> you need a wipe on this phone. I told you your phone smells. Well, they clean their phones regularly. I ne mine's never clean. What phone is that? <laughs> what phone is this? this is the one from the office. The one all right, let me, smell, well, let me smell the phone that no one, you know, okay. no problem. No, I swear, no problem. No problem. Okay. I have smelled Gary's phone. I would like yours. to take this test Hold when the, you're done. Let me see. Oh, no. <laughs> Give me my phone. You want to go smell it? Yeah, sure. Oh. Is it true? Because I, yeah. I didn't believe you guys. He's going to get fed. <laughs> you are good quality. Hey, Gary, how you doing? What? I didn't believe this. I don't smell anything either. Very good. The whole, the whole businessman. Yeah, I don't smell anything. I knew it was about a big phone. Good morning, Mr. Hamill. How are you? How are you? Um, is the plug to is this plug to Mr. Hamill's liking? Right, now it's time okay. for cooking. Now it's time for cooking. Ralph. Yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Right. Somebody's got to go. What? Somebody has to go and make room for Mark Hamill. Ralph, get out of here. Let Mark sit down. I'm going. I'm going. <laughs> Mark Hamill. How'd you get that wife of yours? She's a real I swing. Up, I met her up at the Hefner's mansion. Hey, did you really? Right? Yeah. Hey, sit down. What, well, you she, get her, did you get her right off the she, Star Wars movie? She was a dental hygienist and she cleaned my teeth, actually. God, you're hot. Then she brought me up to... Uh... What were you doing at Hef's mansion? Um. Yeah, what were you hanging doing? Hanging out. Looking hanging for guys? Out. Hey, Nathan, how you doing? That's uh, Mark's son. Hey, you know, you don't mind me talking. Your mom's real hot. I guess you know that, right? And look, I'm sure his friends have told us. Have you, do your friends ever come over to look at your mom? Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> no, Mark, you sit down. Put Nathan on your lap. He's your boy. Yeah. It's okay. Work him like a puppet. What would you like? Nathan, you're lucky your parents are so good looking because you're real good looking. What do you, you have girlfriends and stuff? Tell him no? what happened with the prom this year. What if I did? He got invited to the prom by a senior, and then the school had to call and say it's unacceptable. Really? He, he's real good looking. <laughs> Plus, his dad is Mark Hamill. Yeah. And nobody plays guitar. I mean, he's hip. He's a happening guy. You know? Yeah, well. He's he... musical talent from me, that's for sure. And he plays great guitar. You're going to put him in movies? I don't I hope not. You probably. You want to be in movies, Nathan? Mm, no. No? You want to be a musician? Just get girls all the time and play music? Yeah, me too. <laughs> that's what I'm working toward. I can't, I can't figure out that C chord, though. Uh, God, that's hard. How, when are you going to learn? You're 40 years old. It's nah. a little late to be going on the road. Yeah, it's unbelievable. <laughs> but your mom is really... <sighs> Show them your pictures okay. from, uh, from no, the pay-per-view. Yeah, I was sorry. What are you wearing, a bathing suit? No, no. Night, Do you ever Howard? wear bathing suits? You, you and Allison disappeared right after pay-per-view. We, we should have stopped we wanted... off in your dressing yeah. room and said hi. We, we wanted to meet Allison. Man, you are nice. So that was yeah. New Year's Eve. Wow. Yeah, I think you should have had me be one of the judges. Are you cut out? I yeah, I should have. I heard you got mad because Mark... No, I wasn't mad. I looked as good as any of those. No, people. I heard you were mad when Mark had the stripper in his face and the whipped cream. The cream? Uh, I heard you got upset. No? That's what, yeah, Conan people call Mark. It was Mark Vanessa. Vanessa. Uh, I can't remember her last name, but she was a real Amazonian, statuesque woman. Well, all women are Amazonian to me. So what were, you doing, nine, what were you doing at the Hef Mansion? I guess it's hard to talk in front of your son, but uh -huh. what, what were you doing at the Hef Mansion? Trying did to find a husband? Did you just hang out there? No, like meet yeah. high-profile guys? Hung out. How'd you meet Hef? I mean, how did you get well, to be one of... Well, had girlfriends that were playmates and stuff, right? Yeah. Any girl who's real good-looking gets to hang out at... Hey, Nathan, yeah, they didn't... Why don't you turn around when I talk, They huh? didn't yeah. throw her yeah, out I'm when she him came. Up. I take the kids up on Easter. They have, like, they hide 800 eggs on Where, the Where, Hef's property. mansion? Yeah. And they're real eggs that haven't been fertilized yet by oh. sperm. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're hand-painted hand Easter eggs. So we go up there on Easter, and the kids 
fine egg. So, so yeah. when you were up there that day that you met Mark, was it like a choice between Mark Hamill or Vince Edwards or someone like that? Like, you know, <laughs> or what's that guy who hangs out at the mansion? Harry Reams. Harry Reams. Right. <laughs> Actually, <they're> Lance Rental. <laughs> Lance Rental. <laughs> No, really. But, I mean, I know, like, Mark, what were you doing there? You were just hanging no, out? No, what happened was, in actual fact, I went to have my teeth cleaned, and she was a dental hygienist. I met her that way and asked her out, and then she invited me up to the mansion. You know, I was very excited. I mean, I thought she was a wild a playmate party girl. Right. And 15 years later, you realize she's a mommy. Yeah. You know, as soon as you marry them, they she change. She is a knockout. So and what a body. Nathan, no offense, your mother's got some body. God <laughs> almighty. And your friends don't come over? Like, does your mom ever have, like, pool parties in Hollywood and stuff? Yeah. No? Nah? They never come over and go, hey, your mom's hot and she's you a can't swing. think of your parents that way. Yeah, but I knew a guy in my high school yeah. who had a really hot mother. Did you actually mother. tell yeah. the guy? Yeah, we go, hey, oh. Robbie, can we come over to your house to see your mom? Oh. Yeah, and he would go, oh, come on, you guys. I go, come on, let's, what's she wearing today? And we'd go over and see this guy's mom. And we would just go hang out, and we'd hang out with his mom. We wouldn't even hang out with him. Really? But in junior high school? It's unbelievable. In junior high school? Is that no, this was like in... This was like in, in elementary school, yeah, and, then, and, then, you know, and then into junior high, and right. even into high school. Right, so you'd go over to his house, ditch him, and hang around the mom. Yeah, well, he was a friend of Dr. Lou's, and we'd go over there. Yeah. Watch her do light, light housekeeping. No, no, and then he had a real hot sister, but the mother was even better than the sister. Yeah, I remember. Just like your wife. Like that. I do, I do. And the kids don't come, like, you ever have, like, swimming parties at your house? No. Like, with your friends? You have a pool? Yeah. yeah. Well, then who does have the hot mom? You know. Yeah. Yeah, I guess a lot of these Hollywood kids see hot moms. Yeah. Yeah. Tell us. Um, your friends have never come over your house to hang out and swim? Yeah. yeah. And then your mom's like so she's hanging around in like her bathing suit? I don't know, sometimes. Man. <laughs> what kind of swimsuits do you he wear? He doesn't notice. It's mom, you know. Come on. What kind of swimsuits do you wear? Oh, I have a couple of two-pieces. Really? You wear bikinis and stuff? Mostly one-pieces these days. Oh, man. <laughs> I actually have a suit that matches this dress I bought in Paris. Really? Uh -huh. Can you bring that in the next time you and Mark? <laughs> she I is. I, I. You turn me on. <laughs> Sorry, How Nathan. How can you say that in front of him? Hey, hey, Nathan, man. Parents are sexual beings, you know. I got kids too. We'll be back right after these words. Oh, now I feel good. Were you nervous when you met your wife at the Playboy Mansion that, like, she just wanted to get a hold of your Skywalker millions? No, no, no. This was, I mean, it was before the movie came out. When I was took it? him up to the mansion the first time, I left my purse up there, something they told um, me not to let him out of the car. Because if it's a male, you can't bring any males up. Then after Star Wars was out, he was allowed to get out of the car. Is right. that right? Uh, <laughs> but, you know, I mean, God. You've got some body. Is that the same body as when he married you? I mean, you haven't put no, on a pound. it's not the same body. I've had three kids. Hmm. And... <laughs> Look at this guy, Nathan. He's <laughs> looking at me like I'm going to punch you. <laughs> That's my mom. <laughs> that might be your mom, but I'm going to be thinking about her. <laughs> Damn. Now, why, where did you cut out so fast with Allison after the pay-per-view? I had to have her after you my triumphant night. You didn't see him? No, 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 I'm telling you. The, the, the people he did have, try to come down. Should, order that tape because I was there and I figured why do I need to see the tape I was there I saw the show then you get the videotape and you see all this stuff that went on and you didn't know I was glad Jackie that you confirmed the fact that 10 feet away from us when we were at the table yeah. and Robin you were signing books and whatnot 10 feet away from us was major <laughs> diving going on and, and, and let me say something let me say something I what I'm trying to say here is what I am trying to say here is this is why you should order the tape. Yeah. There's all new stuff going on. You can't believe it. One eight hundred fifty two stories. Let me see if stuttering. We didn't found... see that stuff. We until did not we saw see the tape. that stuff. That's right. I know. It's <laughs> unbelievable. And everyone doesn't believe you. They go, Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> so were you dating like Jimmy Kahn or somebody before Mark Hamill? <laughs> or that no, guy from that I wasn't into that uh, Hunter TV the show. The first time yeah, I went Fred out to Hats on a Sunday night. Sunday night's the big night. All the celebrities come. They show a movie and stuff. Warren Beatty came up to me after the movie and said, you want to go in the jacuzzi? And oh. yeah. Really? Yeah. I said no. She's no cleaning kidding. up that story. Didn't he try and walk in on the shower? Yes. Yeah, so he, he did, huh? Time, yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice guy. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go. She turned down Warren Beatty. Did you really? Yeah, I really did. So you had never been with any guys before, Mark? Oh, yeah. oh wait, I better not ask this in front of your son. <laughs> this is not the kind of thing you want to talk about. Hey, how's it growing up in Hollywood having your dad as Mark Hamill? Is that cool? I mean, that's cool. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. You don't know how good you have it. 
I couldn't get any girls in high school because I didn't have a fame. My father, you know, my He's father got a did senior nothing. asking him out. Yeah. You got a senior ask you to your prom? No, not a senior. Actually, not junior. A senior. Junior? Was she hot? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Even that, see, this is something I haven't heard before. This kid's having more fun than I am. <laughs> <laughs> I told him, I said, you know, in my day, you want to sound like a father. I said, in my day, you know, maybe older a guy, older guys would ask younger girls, but... You know, older women would never ask younger guys. He looked at me and he said, well, yeah, so what's your point? Yeah, who cares about your old pal? <laughs> I guess my yeah. point is, well, times have changed. Yeah. You know, and I sort of walked out with my tail between my legs. But, uh, Plus, you got a rich father. You're pretty, I you can got, see I'm no match for you. But you have computers and all the musical equipment. You and all get cool everything gear. right away. Yeah. No, yeah. he doesn't. No. Yes, he does. No, I mean, we, yeah, you know. He just said, yeah, let oh. the kid talk. Oh, yeah, we have a computer. You have a computer? Yeah. And your father buys you all kinds of neat junk. I mean, for God's sake, your father's like a child. He buys comic books. <laughs> <laughs> your father is a comic book. And McDonald's book. giveaways. Yeah, hey, look at the kid's watch. Collection. That watch is worth more than Steve Gorillo's father makes in a year. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> See what I mean? Steve, what does your father do for a living? He's a mailman. He's a mailman? <laughs> yeah. Hey, Nathan, would you rather have Mark Hamill as your father oh. with his hot mom or a mailman? Well, come on. Try no, that. Saying, of the year. Come I bet on. their pool was in ground. <laughs> yeah, we have the Harrow's pool <laughs> above ground. <laughs> Let me tell you something. It's no picnic being the son of a mailman. <laughs> Although, you can be very proud. The test, I understand, is very hard to uh, pass. That's right, yeah. <laughs> and he does work for the government. Yeah, that's a government. We your father's the, a great guy, but he's a mailman. We have the best mail system. That's right. <laughs> Plus, if Steve's father was your father, your hair would have fallen out by mm. now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Nathan, can I uh, kiss your mom goodbye? Oh. You don't care? <laughs> yeah, you you wouldn't be upset? Sure. Yeah. sure. <laughs> you think I could kiss you goodbye or hug you? What do you think? You think I'd be um, comfortable? Sure. You wouldn't mind? Mark? You're not ready to blast away, no, are no, you? No, I'm not even listening, actually. Why? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's not like I'm going to steal her or anything. No, no. Mark, you can kiss Fred. I'll kiss him. <laughs> <laughs>Sure. I mean, does it bother you? If it bothers you, I won't do no, it. No, no, no. You can be honest. I don't want you to do an O.J. Simpson on me, you know? No, no, no. I don't want you flipping out. Oh, oh, listen, that was the greatest. That that phone call to Peter Jennings you guys played? Yeah, that was a good one, wasn't it? Looky here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you let me hug your wife goodbye, I'll give you an extra Looky plug here. for your comic book appearance. <laughs> <laughs> hug away. All right, come over. Let's hug goodbye. Okay. All right. Should I take mm. these off? I love your dress. Is that a mini dress? Oh, that's a, your mom's mini wearing a mini dress. dress. Mini dress. Hey, <laughs> Nathan, sit down. Yeah, you, you sit down. Nathan. Hug for a plug. <laughs> uh, hug I think it's going to be a lot more than a hey, Nathan, hug cover your, put a piece of paper over Nathan's face. Right? <laughs> this is going to be X-rated. Uh, how tall are you? 5'3". Perfect height for a man 6'5". Yeah. There's a whole lot of women right here. Nathan, put that piece of paper over your face. He put a hole in it. Hey, there's a hole in it. <laughs> Your mother we're talking about here. Are your measurements 36, 24, 36? I don't know. I haven't measured. But you can wear bikinis and get away with it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Show them your really? layout. What Where's your layout? What layout? Yeah, you see, you weren't happy with those pictures that I had clothes on. You want to see something Yeah, were well, you else? in Playboy? No, not exactly. She, she, Hefner wanted her to be, and she was afraid her parents would react badly, so she said, can I do the layout and change my mind? And he Ooh. said, yeah. Oh, no. What are you seeing there? Did you ever see these, Nathan? No way. Yeah, this, this Nathan, you can't here. look. Oh, here. I'll show the camera. No, 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 no. Oh, that you, you can show the camera. Really nice. You're in a shadow. Ooh, can I show that to the camera? You show these to Nathan? Nathan, you saw these? I don't know. You said naked pictures. Did you show it to him? He's seen this. This is beside the You didn't bed. show him this one, did you? Probably not. Oh, man. <laughs> can I show this on camera? Yeah, here. Uh, look at this one. Look at Mark. No, I don't think so. It's a naked pictures of what your mom. Just turn around. Oh, your mother's beautiful. This is a work of art. This yeah. isn't nudity. <laughs> See, that's the one that's by the bedside. Everybody yeah. Oh, Anybody that comes to our house. You, you keep this at your bed? Your, yeah. your chest is exposed. So? Nathan, when your friends come over, do they ask to see the picture of your mom <laughs> naked? Yeah. They, they don't? Yeah. They're not, they do? Oh, they didn't know about this. <laughs> Are you, hey, wait a second. Aren't you in, we have a picture, like a cartoon drawing of a naked woman in our bedroom. Like uh -huh. it's, it's by this guy, Waterman. He's an artist. Right. My wife bought it. Yeah. And the kids all bring their friends up to see the picture. It's just like a little cartoon drawing. It's uh -huh. just a line drawing. A it's line drawing. A real body. If your friends saw this, they go out and, I, look at this picture. <laughs> hubba, hubba. You can't leave this in the house. You can't leave this where his friends can see it.
Are you crazy? I don't, I don't know. Yeah, Miss Prince, not... see that? It's over for No, him. but I mean, come on. It's the human body. They went to France. The human body? It's his mom. They, they yeah. went to France. I wouldn't show you naked pictures so of my mother. There's so much more sex in advertising there. Yeah. Everything. I mean, you, can, you <laughs> see, you see, what's the product here? It'll be like orange juice. Were you breastfed? Do you know? Yeah, you were. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Man, no kidding. How long did that go? On? He probably did it till he was ten. Yeah. <laughs> He's still breastfeeding. Uh, Fourteen months for him, two and a half years for Griffin, and uh, four years for Chelsea. Four years? That's sick. <laughs> See, I told you your wife was not doing it right. Four years. How long did Allison, man. How long did Allison Ten the longest minutes. time? Hey, let's get the kid a hypnotist in here and, and help the, hip, the hypnotist help him bring back the memory. <laughs> That's unbelievable. How many years have you been breastfeeding, Mark? <laughs> oh, now I feel good. All right, come on, let's okay. hug. Oh, okay. man, wait a second. I got to get a good one. Hey, put Nathan, don't look. Come on, man. I want to hug you. What are you doing? I'm just hugging and then. I don't know and what's going on. Groping, I'm it's sure. So wrong. You wearing underwear? Yeah. You are? Yeah. And a bra? Uh huh. I don't want Nathan to hear this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I just want to be loved. Is that right, so wrong? Okay. Oh, 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 baby. Oh, don't stop now. You know you want me to hug you more. All right. All right. Oh, okay. You're a good guy. Huh? Hey, let me tell you something. I'm only being good because your son is here. <laughs> Oh, great shades of Baba Booey. Yeah. Oh, man, you're a lucky man. Oh. Beautiful family. Yeah. Oh, wait a second. Come sit on my lap. Uh. My hand. <laughs> you don't get that treatment. You guys still, uh, oh, I want to ask you in front of you. Oh. Hey, Nathan, can, don't you have somewhere to go? Uh, <laughs> nah. Don't you have some friends to call for the prom? <laughs> I got a bunch of questions, but I won't ask him in front of Nathan. Okay. Next time. Because he's 15. Next time when we'll leave him home. But you still, you two are very, very passionate about each other very still, right? Active. Yeah, very active. <laughs> yeah. God forbid Nathan. We're so, I mean, uh, Nathan shouldn't hear that because my parents, I don't think, have been active for like 20 years. Oh, yeah. They're on the inactive they list. They probably are active right now as you speak. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're active vomiting. <laughs> well, we've been married about the same t uh, t uh, amount of time as you and Allison, right? Mm. I don't know. I didn't meet Allison at the Playboy Mansion, though. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I met her outside the... Well, wait a minute. Your son's 15 and you've been married 15 years? Shh. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Oh, math is never our strong subject. Oh, <laughs> Thank you very much. Whatever that happened, 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 Nathan. Thanks so You're lucky much, to be here. Man. Thanks so much. I'm pointing that out. you got a lot oh. of explaining to do to Nathan. <laughs> Nathan, you ever done the math oh, on that? 16 no, no. years. Never? It'll be 16 years. No, 16 years. You oh, were in a rush okay. to have a child. Uh, almost 16. Right. You wanted to have children very yeah. quickly. Yeah. <laughs> Probably had a long cab ride home from the mansion. <laughs> it wasn't an accident. I know. I know. Believe me, there's no accidents when it comes to you, my dear. There are no accidents. I'd enjoy having an accident. You are something. What a picture that is. I should have been a judge for New Year's. You didn't marry Mark for his money, though, or for, because no, you met, met him before. Him before the really? Uh -huh. So you just thought he was a cute guy? He said I'd done a movie. I thought, well, so did everyone else. I actually done a movie. I cleaned Sam Spiegel's teeth, and I got put in the last I could. Yeah, and I wanted to ask her about that, what she had to do besides clean his teeth to get into the movie. Hey, hey, you ever see the last I could with Robert De Niro? She has one line. How did they do the earthquake in San Francisco? That's the line? <laughs> That's the line. Mm. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to rent that movie. Are you naked when you do that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, too bad. No wonder you were at Hef's Mansion. you posing those pictures. You got a, you, you're an interesting that. woman. Yeah. You're a I very interesting here. woman. Before I moved to L.A., actually. You're no prude. <laughs> mm. Judge the pageant. You should have been in the pageant. <laughs> All right, listen. I got to go. I want to remind everyone, if you want to see the great Mark Hamill, will your wife be there? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. What are you going to wear? <laughs> yeah, really. I have another outfit. It was a choice between that one and this one for today. Mm. Nathan, you're going too? What? Am I? Yeah. Are you? Do you want to go? Well, there might be some girls well, there. Yeah. Be Think about it, Nathan. Mark Hamill, <laughs> who does the voice of the Joker in the Batman animated series. Yeah. Must be cool to have a dad who does something cool like that, you know? Yeah. Actually, I'm doing this new series where the character I play is somewhat based on you. It's, it's a series called Phantom 2040, and I play this, uh, sh well, I hate that term, shock jock. Uh -huh. it's, it's so cliched. But, uh, yeah, uh, but use it anyway. All right. <laughs> but thanks for stopping by, Mark. Good to see you. And Nathan, good to meet you. I try to behave myself in front of you, but your mom's a hot. You, you couldn't help yourself. Your mom's a definite swing. <laughs> hey, who's cooler, me or your father? 
Uh, yeah. Thanks. Oh. Good. You ask them that every time we come in. I just in. want to make sure I'm still there. <laughs> My kids don't think I'm cool at all. That's why. Well, that's because you're their father. Yeah, they think Mark Hamill's cool. Okay. <laughs> I resent that. All right, I'll see you guys later. All right. mm. I'll be Very thinking hard about to be cool to your own kids. Be thinking about you tonight. Who, Nathan? Yeah, he's hot. <laughs> no, I'm talking about <clears throat> Mark's wife. Oh. Could you leave the pictures? Yeah. <laughs> Put them on the back of the door, right? Oh no. <laughs> what kind of shoes are you wearing? I didn't even look. Ooh. Oh, those are cute. Talking? Yeah, those are cute. Those are cute stockings. <laughs> All right, you've done your job. <laughs> I'll see you, Mark. See you, folks. Mark had a cup. Oh, I always have fun in Howard. Always. He's amazing. This guy is like the only humorist that can take and be spontaneously funny. That's what I really am impressed about Howard. I mean, I've never heard him not be funny, and that's money in the bank. How do you like being on the air with Howard? Oh, I think Howard's great. I enjoy um, listening to him. Uh, my only problem is when I carpool with um, these little kindergarten girls, I can't turn the radio on. I drop them off and then turn it on. All right. We'll see you tomorrow, Rob.